Hi and uh, welcome back. I got this uh, air micro die grinder kit from Banggood as a free gift. And it comes in this nice box. But what is not so nice is that it has been heavily crushed during the transportation. So, what have we got here? We got 10 grinding pins in different formats. And the size of the shaft is 3 millimeters or 1/8 inch. We got a bottle for lubrication. It uh, will be filled up with uh, special air oil. I got a bottle here that is uh, especially made for air tools. And uh, we got some kind of oiler here for the tool. This will be filled up with air tool oil. And we got an attachment here that uh, screws on here. And here you connect the hose from the compressor. And the other end goes to the air tool, of course. And we got an extra collet here. And this is not for 3 millimeters but 2.4 millimeters and uh, we also got the, the tool and the maximum RPM is 65,000 at the 6 bars pressure and it's got a 3 millimeters collar chuck here and we got some tools for tightening and loosening this these two simple tools so I will now mount uh, everything together fill this up with air oil and we will test this tool I just realized that this ain't gonna work because this connection doesn't fit my air hose connections as you can see this part should look like this like so so what am I going to do about this then well I was thinking of cutting this piece off and uh, cut off a piece here and then join these two parts together by hole soldering. I think that will, will uh, be okay. I will try that. So here's the deal. I will be cutting this off here. suit this and then join them together I 
I think I can press these two parts together. And uh, here are the two parts together. They are not that tight. I can rotate this as you can see. And now I was thinking of uh, hard solder these two parts together. And uh, here it is, after some cleaning, I think this will work quite alright. Well, let's try it now. That seems to be very well. So, next thing to do is to try this out, and I forgot to mention that it also comes with a operation instruction, like this, if you don't know how to use this tool. Uh, now I got this connected to my air hose that goes to my compressor. And as you can see, I got some air oil. And uh, how does this work? Well, you turn this. Like so. got some diamond cut-off wheels, small ones, but uh, this one doesn't come with this kit. And uh, this grinding wheels doesn't come with the kit either. Let's try a, a bigger grinding wheel and see how that performs.
I think I will have to loosen this a bit. It's a like this. So we try that. And uh, now I changed to this uh, diamond cutoff disc, and we'll try that. Also got a set of these small tools, and for this I I must use the other collet, the smaller one. Let's try one of these and see how it performs. One thing that I did forget to mention is that the air that goes into the tools, the tool <coughs> gets out here. And uh, even some oil are coming out here too when I'm using this tool. So I don't know if you need to have this oil or you can just uh, put in a few drops of oil here in the connection every time now and then when you are using this tool if you think that these grinding tools are small I have uh, some others that are even smaller I show you there are some smaller ones and uh, the shaft on this one are 1.6 millimeters. I can compare it with this one. Actually, these little tools are dentist tools, and some of them are coated with a diamond. So this is what your dentist is using when you are in the dentist chair and uh, these small ones this collet doesn't fit this one so maybe I will make a new collet that even fits these smaller ones that got the hole in it that is uh, 1.6 millimeters
So, what do I think about this micro air dry grinder? Well, I think it's pretty nice, in fact. I think it will be good for smaller grinding jobs. And um, I can recommend it. Um, thank you for watching this uh, review. And uh, I will be back soon. Bye-bye.